Hello YouTube, my name is Josh Bryan. I work with BNB. At BNB we specialize in working with a HP ALM. Today we are going to be talking about how to enable Excel reporting in HP ALM 12. As I'm sure you're aware, HP ALM 12 does not come with Excel reporting out of the box. So this is going to uh, show you how to enable that feature. So let's get started. So this is HP ALM 12 right out of the box. As you can see, there are not the there is not the uh, Excel reports. Again, we're in the dashboard analysis view. No Excel reports. So let's log out here, and we're going to hop over to the site admin. Okay, so we're in the site admin and the site configuration. Now, what we're going to do is we're going to add a new parameter. Click new. Now, the new the parameter name is enable create legacy Excel report um, with a underscore under between each word. So let's do that now. Oops. Enable create legacy Excel. Parameter value, we're going to put a Y for yes, we're enabling that description. We are uh, allowing Excel reports. Okay, oops. So, comes in now the bottom. If we click refresh, it's going to pull up as it's alphabetized. We see it there. Come back to our instance. Let me re-log in. Now you are going to have to re-log in to see these changes. And here we are. Now if you'll notice, we see the new Excel report, which wasn't here last time. So that is how you add that. Again, my name is Josh Bryan with BNB. Uh, we do specialize in helping uh, companies with their ALM issues and implementing that to the best of their abilities. If you have any questions about this or anything else we provide over at BNB, feel free to get, shoot us an email at info at We'd be more than happy to uh, help you out there. And thanks for watching.